Thanks to a recent update, you can now animate stickers and text using loop animation like this. I can show you how. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here and you're looking for technology tips, tricks, and tutorials, you've come to the right place. If you find this video helpful, subscribe. You can use the loop animation feature to animate stickers and text. Unlike the glitch transitions, which I discussed in my last video, these animations are free, regardless of what version of InShot you're using. I'm going to restore the pro version of InShot and I'll show you how I added the top sticker. Stick around to the end of the video for a demonstration on how to use loop animations with text. You can animate any stickers on videos only. I'm going to load in a video I've already been working on. To add a sticker, tap the stickers icon. Because I'm using the pro version, I can use any one of the sticker packs I want. Select a sticker by tapping on it. You can resize and reposition the sticker anywhere on the video. To resize the sticker, use the arrow in the corner or pinch and zoom. To move the sticker, long press and drag it anywhere on the video clip. Tap on the pencil and then tap animate. This is the animation window. There are a bunch of transitions you can use to animate any sticker. The top ones are the basic transitions. Underneath those, you have the loop animations. If you select a loop animation, such as the bounce, it will repeat over and over again for the entire duration that the sticker appears on the video. Watch as I scroll through the rest of the loop animations. This one's the heartbeat. Choose an animation and then tap the check mark. Now you have to select the amount of time that you want the sticker to appear on the video. This video has two clips. So I'm going to leave the sticker on screen until the end of this clip. I can scrub back and forth through the timeline to show you that the sticker will be animated. There's the start of the second clip. Let's take a look at a more useful example. Just like before, you can add your own photos as stickers. I'm going to choose the subscribe image. I want the image to appear for the entire length of the second clip. So I'll set the clip duration to the end of the second clip. It needs to be resized and repositioned. Do that by pinching or zooming and dragging the image to the spot where you want it. Tap on the pencil icon and tap animate. Below you will see the loop animations. Choose the one you want and then tap the check mark. This heartbeat one looks pretty good. I'm going to use this one. Tap on the check mark once you've made your selection. As you can see, you do not need to do these steps in a specific order. To save the video, tap the share icon. Then tap save. Processing will begin. Don't lock the screen or switch between apps while this is happening. If you do, the video will not save properly. The completed video can now be found inside your video's library. 
This video clip contains some text that I want to animate using a loop animation. Tap on the T, tap on the pencil icon, and select Edit. Tap on the Animation icon next to the font icon. This is the animation window. Below the basic animations, there are the loop animations. I'm going to select the heartbeat animation. The text pulses like a heartbeat. Tap the check mark when you've made your selection. You can play the clip or add more text. When you're done, tap the check mark. Tap the play icon to play this clip to see how the video looks. That looks great. To save the video, tap the share icon, then tap save. Processing will begin. Don't lock the screen or switch between apps while this is happening. If you do, the video won't save properly. The completed video can be found inside your video's library. I love Mike's videos. Please subscribe to his channel for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. If you have a problem with any part of this process, leave a comment below so I can help you. Don't forget to click that thumbs up if you liked the video. Please feel free to check out some of my other videos suggested on screen. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.